Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you're doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 notification video. Today is Tuesday, so we should be having something at the Atomic Chopper new. Plus, it's a new month. Maybe we got something for Fallout first, so we're gonna take a look at that. Uh, afterwards, take a look at the daily weekly challenges. Uh, take a look on what we got for the daily ops today. I'll do my daily run and show you the final reward at the end. I hope it's not the signs again. <laughs> Place your bets. What am I gonna get on daily ops today? Let's go. But let me stop talking here and let's jump to the video. Alright, so I actually kept my first impression, so let's see what's up. At the moment I'm logging in with my main account, so uh, we'll see the main page and the follow first section. Afterwards I'll switch to my wife's account so we can see the full discounts on the items I already own. Here goes nothing. Boom. Oh yeah, I love that badge right there with follow first. And what we got here, and we, 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 what the... Oh, <laughs> hello. Oh, Shazam, this thing is huge. <laughs> I'm going to grab it right now. I'm going to show it to you right now. All right, so this thing is huge, and it's actually electricity generator. <laughs> I wish I read that when I was reviewing the, the atomic shop, and I wouldn't spend maybe like 10 minutes trying to locate this thing. But it's huge, as you can see. Uh, there it is, boom, and let's, uh, so it generates, uh, 12 electricity, boom, that's if you place it right there, oh, actually it spins, it's, it's cool, I like, I like, uh, how much budget does that take, by the way, I'm curious, uh, so, if we, uh, store this thing, boom, and you can pay attention to the build budget right now, boom. Not that much, not that a lot. Oh, sweet! So you can build actually a whole bunch of these things. Uh, two variants. Uh huh. So this is the the default version that we all have, and bam, we got this thing right here, and it looks like we can build twenty of these. Like, and I got seven out of twenty, so I can keep building these. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> I freaking love it. <laughs> Alright, uh, let me jump to my wife's account so we're going to review everything else. Alright, now let's take a look what we got here. Uh, lumberjack bundle. Ooh. I do not remember who made the video. I think it was SH Games who've mentioned about these. This, the lock cabin kit. And there we go. Now we have them. I personally never used these apart from the glass one that I, we've earned in season two. That's the only one I've used that which has a complexity of building, like, you know, all these types of options. But yeah, you gotta admit, it's actually looking good. Well, not my thing, to be honest. Um, so most probably I'm just gonna wait for a discount with this specific bundle. But. It includes their devil's outfit. Is that it? Damn. Uh, tree top daredevil's hat. I think that's the one right over there. Uh, then the log cabin kit. That's what we've shown all of that entire building with separate pieces. The log chairs. Uh, I believe those ones. They should be on the main page. They are sellable individually from the bundle. And the decorative rock set. I don't know. <laughs> they don't look like decorative. I mean, if there were like some a little bit of crystal or some gold shards, you know, that'll be decorative. This is just a rock. <laughs> and there we go. So that's the outfit that's included within the bundle, right? Wait. So that means there is new exclusive. Yeah, outfit, hat, cabin kit. Yeah, no exclusive. Well, that sucks. Uh. The log table. The log table. I missed that one. So it's also included. There we go. Uh, 
the chairs, okay, with the lock table, maybe those chairs are included with the bundle. No, I don't think so. Well, sometimes they, they, they kind of like, they show that, that, hey, we got a table, but you also get the chairs as well. And then there was never mentioning of do you get the chairs or not. But anyway, uh, there's a whole bunch of chairs in this game, even without Atomic Shop. So trust me, you'll definitely find some chair to fit that in with that table. So Thrax it. <laughs> As I said, it looks just a, like a damn rock. If they would have like something gold or silver sticking out, or I don't know, something cool, something unique. But you know what? If you kind of making like a, actually, you know what? I take that back. They are you, you can use them as decor if you're like making some greenhouse style stuff. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Well, I don't know. Well, I'm not getting it. That that. Are you freaking serious right now? I officially announced I have I had this feeling and now I'm I'm like 100% that this is thing is real. First of all, this was a reward for season 1. Second of all, if I'm not mistaken, you was able to buy this Oh no, wait. I own it. So it's another chicken coop that I do not own. I take that Oh wait, no 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 no. I'm on my wife's account right now. Damn, I'm gonna have to check this when I log in with my main. This is uh, follow first, and we were able to buy with gold bullion. I'm pretty sure I just don't remember which vendor. Now they're reselling it for 500 atoms. Are you serious? I mean, uh, they resold already the ammo machine, which were supposedly supposed to be bought by uh, gold bullion. So I officially announced that they will be reselling all of the season stuff at some point. So you you will see. Weapon skins reselling, you'll see all those outfits, all those power armor skins, everything that they've included in seasons. I have a big, 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 big now belief, like 99.99% .99 sure that they will be selling those for atoms. <laughs> yeah, probably running out of ideas and don't know what to put in the atomic shop. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, if now this is the second item which is coming here uh, for atoms from the seasons, uh, let's we're waiting for the lift bench. We're waiting what for, for for all of those stuff. So yeah, I'm pretty sure now, like season one items will start shrinking into the, sinking with the atomic shot. Then season two will start sinking with the atomic shot. Then season three will start sinking with the atomic shot. And then <laughs> I will not be surprised if we'll see season one bundle. <laughs> not not <enough. laughs> Okay, that was just me being I don't know. <laughs> Ah, uh, okay. Let's forget that just happened. But anyway, yeah. <laughs> hey, we got the hat. Hey, so what we got here? Uh huh. That was last week. Okay, cool. That bolt is good. I made a review. It's good. It's dope. It's got an aquarium. It's massive. It's big, and I still didn't start building it. Although, I just never had the time. I'm too busy with ESO right now, trying to figure out my build. I'm respecting like I don't know 50 times now. Uh, greatest hits. Uh, ooh, wow, that is so. This is more love. Greatest love hits. <laughs> All right, so we got some pinky stuff. Oh, plushie. I like it, but not for three hundred. <laughs> okay, shared love bundle. Oh yeah, this is the heart. I was thinking of getting this just because of this heart, just because of that heart. But man, 1,400 atoms just because I want to have that heart. I don't know, man. Ish. That's a terrible outfit combo. Could have used some other cool outfit with that pink bag. All right, Volt. Ting, meaning what leaving soon white springs resort bundle which I'm actually thinking of grabbing just because of the stage but don't know oh wait oh yeah the, this this is pretty dope as well I, I've encountered at somebody else's camp and I played it and it's just make that real cool sound you know uh, golf car right well I already reviewed this you already all pretty know this uh, the heart wrench it's been available because we're doing challenges for this right now. 
So we're going to take a look at the weekly challenge. And last time we got an outfit, which I made a review for. All right, so that's uh, looks like pretty much it. Let me switch back to my main. Man, you got to admit, that thing is cool. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, <laughs> that's actually, yeah, I love it. All right, so the chicken coop, by the way. There you go. Yeah, you see, I own it. I own it. Mm. But this thing, yeah, this thing made my day, man. It's pretty cool. All right, so that is uh, pretty much it for the Atomic Shop. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Special Blood Raider skin. This is Fallout First. So there must be uh, some sort of a discount for this, but I already own it. This skin is great. I've been using it when I've been when I was using power armors back in the day. You can collab it with a lot of different other armor pieces, and it's just perfecto. Uh, yeah, and that's pretty much it. All right, let's take a look at the ch oh wait challenges. I'm gonna start with the weekly one because I want to see what's up with over here. Okay, so kill super mutants with the heart wrench 30 times and you get some green backwoods bungalow. Damn. <laughs> okay, cool. Alright, let's head back to back to the dailies. Quickly read through this. Uh, build floor wall decorations inside a shelter. Buy an item or sell an item from another player three times. Collect 250 caps. Uh, complete daily operation, complete an event, do five dailies, this triggers automatically, level up one time using stim pack three times at nuclear winter, and spread the love, kill the enemies with a heart range five times, and you'll get a repair kit. The atomic shop version one, which sucks. Uh, use it instantly, because it's got weight. And get rid of scrap kits. Uh, I don't know, I just have them piled up, I forgot to delete them. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, so where I was saying you can actually clop that with the super mutant weekly challenge th over here uh, Buy an item was sell an item 25 times man Just buy one bullet 25 times Daily operations completed five times uh, complete the daily gold star and if you do all the dailies today You will trigger that automatically do 10 events Craft, scrap clothing, armor, weapons 25 times, eat pre-war food, this is where the Halloween candy candy comes into play. That's why I always recommend if you don't have food and you want to have food for these types of challenges and you see the Monster Mash in Vitoga, go do that event. You'll get hundreds of those candies. Just one event and you're good stacked up for a couple of months to complete these challenges pretty easy because some, sometimes we even get candy challenges. Uh, okay, kill a huge creature, so we got a list over here, death club, mega sloth, and so on and so forth. Uh, kill a legendary enemy ten times, level up three times, repeatable, and uh, everything else I had covered. So, in regards to that event that I've mentioned, Vatoga is right over here, in case if you did not know. The event starts at the Vatoga High School. Actually, it is a pretty cool event. It even spawns a good amount of legendaries as well. Okay. Daily Ops, what we got there? Boom. Valet Galleria, robots and freezing touch. Alright, so have you already <laughs> placed your best one I'm going to get today? Because, <laughs> man, I don't know. Please, no signs. <laughs> yeah, here comes the moment of truth. By the way, this time there was a lot of robots. I'm sorry. Elder and Connor Daddy. 4,000 speed, 5 script. <laughs> I hate this game. Man, that is some cockroach games. I'm so fed up with getting those stupid signs. But anyway, I hope you found this video useful, entertaining, and uh well if you did, you know the real. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below, please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can respond to them. So if you want your comments to be read, feel free to comment. The only thing that I ask of you is not to swear, so you can provide your negative, positive feedback. Whichever, just don't swear, and people will be able to read it, respond to it, etc. 
Uh, if you're new and you subscribe, well, welcome to ZClan. I'm Gamer Z Saul from Ukraine. So hi from Ukraine. Uh, feel free to join our Discord. We have over 800 members. We cover Fallout 76 over there, a whole bunch of chats, uh, Atomic Shop chats, uh, Setup Team chats, Nuclear Winter chats, PvP chats, and so on and so forth, as well as other games uh, that we start playing, uh, ESO, some uh, like you know single player stuff. All you gotta do is just follow the link, which is down in the video description. Read our rules. Make sure you follow them or you will get banned. And uh, in the access to chats section, just mark what you want to see in terms of chats because we have a lot of chats. <laughs> and trust me, just if you want to see just 76, just click 76 and you'll see only 76. But you also got to click the Z to accept the rules so you see the trade chats and you know, <laughs> that sort of stuff. Alright folks, this is where I'm going to call it the end for this uh, video. You all have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys like it, I'll see you on the next video. Bye. From the